Okay guys, story time. So every year our chorus went on a trip and my senior year was a pretty fun one. We went to Boston. Now the trip was mostly normal except for the end. On the last night, um, it was normal. I was, went to sleep. All of a sudden I was woken up. Someone just burst into our bed, started screaming, scooch off or scooch off, roll over. I am not a night person and I was starting to get ticked. Now, normal people, it doesn't bug them that much when they're woken up, but me, I tend to go rage mode. What's up me is when I heard the words, he puked. <sighs> the dreaded words that I hate to hear, I, I don't deal with puke. So I'm just laying in bed, I'm like, put the sheets over my head. As long as I'm in my own little world, it doesn't matter. So all I can hear is the kids in the hallway talking to the teacher in charge, um, our course teacher. and. While that's going on, I decided I'm the oldest in the room, so I was like, okay, I should probably go out there and be responsible since I am the oldest. While I'm out there in the hallway, I'm in fetal position. While I was out there in the hallway in fetal position, all I could hear was the noises of him puking. My face went white. I don't, I, uh. Now while this was happening, my two friends that were in the room with us were just chuckling because they saw how like pale I was and how sick I was getting from this. The chorus teacher decided it'd be a smart idea to send me down to get a drink. So went down, got us a drink, came back up. Everything normal. We had to move out of the room. Cause it wasn't just normal, like puke one spot, we're good. It was everywhere. Like every corner, there was even under the lampshade. There was no spot spared. His puke decimated the room. So we had to go to our friend's room. So he told us, grab your blankets and stuff and head out. So me being the genius that I am, decided to grab the sheets, throw them over my head and run out the door. Now, most people, if they run into the door, they run into it normally, like bam, head on. Me, I'm a little bit special and I hit the door sideways. Um, it's hard to explain, so I'm just gonna show you what happened. So we had to end up going, knocking on the door to our friend's room. They came out, had no clue what was going on. We explained everything. And we ended up sleeping on the next floor. In the morning, we had to go collect our stuff from the room, which I was excited for. There's people everywhere. I don't want to get nastiness on my stuff. So I just grabbed my stuff and ran out the room. Back then, it didn't seem like such a great situation, but now I just laugh. And I hope you guys liked this story and laughed at it too. If you like this story, don't be afraid to click that thumbs up button. And also that subscribe button is also looking pretty tempting right now. So until next time, guys, I'll talk to you later. Bye.